In this lesson, we will see how to use a hash set in C++, Java, and Python. All the three languages have uh, some inbuilt support for a hash set. So first, let's look at in C++. So in C++, you need to include the unordered set header, and then you have to create an instance of unordered set and you will uh, define the type here in this case we are storing uh, values of type int so we are specifying int here so unordered set of integers and then we can insert multiple keys into it using uh, the insert method so now the hash set has one key that is six now it has six and nine now it has three elements if you insert six again or any of the existing keys it will not take it since the keys are unique now uh, in order to check whether a key exists in the set or not you can uh, use the count method so if the key is present it will return one if the key is not present it will return zero so five we have not inserted so it should print zero but let's print a key which is present for example nine so in this case it will print one now let's erase one of the keys so in this case we erase nine now again if we print count for nine this time it will print zero you can also use a clear method to clear all the elements if you want to make the set empty and there are many more methods and you can explore the language documentation for the same here i have mentioned the bare minimum uh, methods that you will need to work with uh, the hash sets in different languages now let's see the same example in java so we will import java.util and we will import everything and then here we have this hash set class and here also we are specifying the type that is integer and new hash set of the same type and then we can add it so in C++ we had insert here we have add so we will add the same keys and we will print using the contains method so if the key is present the contains method will re return true otherwise false so in this case for 5 it will print 5 false for 9 it will print true now we remove 9 using the remove function and now it should print false for 9 so it should be 9 here or that was to demonstrate the example that 9 has been deleted so make, make a correction here now let's see it in python so uh, you can also use the set method set class on this so you can write set and then you can uh, give a list to the constructor of the set but let's take the simplest form that is hash set and then you have these two curly braces and these uh, will be treated as a set so now it all uh, it is uh, initialized with two elements we can add more elements using add method and then we can print if the key is present or not using in method so 5 in this has set if it's not present it will return false if a key is present it will return true now we remove a key using the remove method and again if you check for the presence of key 9 in this hash set it will return false so uh, these were the three main languages which you will code and how to use hash set in those languages